Welcome everyone. In today's video, we'll be talking about compound interest. As the saying goes, money doesn't grow on trees. But I'm here to tell you today that there's a powerful financial tool that is often used to grow money very rapidly over time. And that tool is called compound interest. Unlike simple interest that we discussed in our last video, where the interest is fixed and can only grow linearly with time, in compound interest, the interest grows exponentially with time. This is because when you make your principal investment or loan and it is set to compound annually, that means that the interest earned after each year gets added to the principal, which in turn generates more interest for the following year. We will see an example of that now. In this first example, I will be showing you how to use the simple interest formula to calculate a question that involves compound interest. In the question below, it says Mr. Blackman invests $5,000 for two years at annual rate of 15% compound interest. Calculate the amount after this period. To jog your memory, this is the formula that we will use to find the interest earned after the first year. The formula for simple interest is interest equals principal multiplied by rate multiplied by time divided by 100. So let's substitute in the values. We have 5,000 for the principal, the rate being 15, and the time being two years. We are only calculating for the first year. So we're gonna leave that as one. So now our values are substituted. We just simply calculate the interest after the first year, which should be $750. Now we must take that interest earned and add it to the principal. So that should give us 5,000 plus $750 to give us $5,750 as our new principal for the second year. So we now we repeat the process using our new principal we work out the interest after the second year. So the interest earned should be $862.50. Now to find the total money earned after that period, we must take the principal plus the interest, and therefore the total money earned over that two years of growth is $6,612.50. Now that we've calculated our answer using this method, let us imagine that Mr. Blackman's investment was for 10 years. As you can see, this method is very tedious and will take a very long time to calculate your amount after that period. Now I'm here to show you that there is a simple way to solve compound interest problems and that will be using the compound interest formula. This may be the first time you've seen this formula so I'm going to explain what each of the terms mean. A stands for the amount of money that you earn after a certain amount of years. P stands for the principal. R stands for the rate percent per annum, meaning per year. And N stands for the number of years. So we're going to use this same formula to see if we can calculate this, the amount earned from Mr. Blackman in the previous question. So using the formula, we're going to plug in the values for principal, rate, a number of years, the principal being 5,000, the rate being 15, and n being 2. So now that we have our values plugged in, you may use your calculator to solve for the amount earned. Now, in most cases, you may have to work out the part of the formula in the bracket first, and then square it, and then multiply by 5,000. If you have a newer calculator or a fancier model calculator, you may be able to input all of the information in one go. But let's see what he earned. We should get the same $6,612.50. Now if you enjoyed that video, feel free to like and share it with your friends. You can always visit us at knowledgegrow.com where you can look at our full list of services that we offer to secondary and high school students. Here's also where you would come to browse our full catalog of featured videos as well as sign up for any of our reasonably priced online courses. Now if you would like to see more free educational content like this, 
you can feel free to visit our donation page. The link is in the description below. It is here where you can donate to us to sponsor our next video using a variety of payment options. You may use mMoney if you are Barbadian. You may use PayPal. Or we support any of your favorite cryptocurrencies such as Bitcoin, Ethereum, and Litecoin. My name is Kevin and I thank you for watching and I hope we meet again.